Hi guys, Random Pink Eyes 13, and today's video is going to be a super duper exciting video because today's video would be the second ever video I upload where I take you guys along with me and my skateboarding journey. So I would really, really appreciate it if you subscribe down below and follow the journey by clicking that red subscribe button and make it gray and hit that post notification bell button right next to the subscribe button so that way you get notified every time I upload sort of like a little text message from YouTube that says ding 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 ding, Pink Eyes 13 posted. Give this video a huge thumbs up to show your love and support and share this video with your friends and family in case I say anything informative or funny or anything in general and that way we can make the pink eyes family grow I also have an eBay shop if you would be interesting in checking it out I would truly 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 appreciate it I make and sell organic vegetarian lip balms and I really suggest you checking the description box down below because I have a whole bunch of discount codes and discount links that will give you amazing, amazing deals. So I'm always writing updates. They are on like show reviews or like new music drops. And yeah, so let's get on with the video. And thank you, thank you so much, guys. We're very close to 600 subscribers. We're 20 subscribers away. And I'm so happy to see my Mermaid Acorn family grow. We are the best internet family in the world. <laughs> so I'm gonna give you like a little story time on my skateboard. So my dad usually wakes up Sunday mornings like at seven in the morning to go do Walmart grocery shopping for the week. Sometimes I wake up, sometimes my mom wakes up, and, but most of the time my dad goes alone to Walmart. And, but there's sometimes when I wake up, there's sometimes, like, if I, if I really want something, there's something about your body that's like, okay, body, we're gonna wake up at a certain time. So, like, any little sound you hear, like, around that time, somehow God sends, like, a message to your body, and then he's like, wake up, and you wake up. <laughs> I've always known that Walmart has had skateboards because, you know, growing up and going to the toy section, and then you pass by the skateboards, and then I'd ride them in Walmart, like you know like in the toy section i can't believe eight years ago i was like i want a skateboard and now eight years later i have a skateboard <laughs> so there was only two options it was either this deck or it would have like a skull from the same brand the tony hawk signature series and i thought it was cool you know like rocket ship space like, if you think about it, the solar system is really cool. Like, science is, like, advanced and knows a lot about Earth. But, like, come on now. Like, every year, science is always making all these new discoveries. So, we're not even done discovering our own Earth. Now, imagine all the other planets in the solar system. So, you guys are looking at the board right now. And then you're like, that's not a real skateboard. It's a Walmart board. I know. I know it's a Walmart board. And I know it's not as good. I know it's not good. If you guys notice, I got wheels. I went to Zoomies and I know, I know, I know, I know, I should have gone to my local skate shop, but I didn't realize it until afterwards because it's my first skateboard, you know? And like, I was just getting into the skate scene. I didn't know a lot. I'm a really big fan of Skate Moss. I think she's really cool. Okay, so personally, I'm scared to ride my skateboard around in my street because like you know how ground isn't like smooth so like I think oh my god if I fall in the middle of the street I'm gonna get like a really bad bruise and then my driveway it's it's like to an angle it's like this so like if I like I'd say more like this but it's to an angle to the point where like if I put my skateboard alone it'll roll down and I'm still not at that place where I'm able to skateboard at an angle I still need to skateboard and like a flat surface where there's no bumps or anything like that because I could fall and I'm, and I'm really scared. I, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm I'm not the most confident skater. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna skate here. And I don't care if I fall because I ha actually had three really bad falls last week. So I had to stop skating for like a week. The first fall, I don't even know how it happened. My dad says that it was like with a pebble because my parents always accompanied me to the skate park. But um, I didn't see a pebble. A part of me feels like my barrels like froze for a second, but my barrels are new. So I want to believe my dad with, that it was a pebble. Then the second time, um, I think it was me going down the ramp and trying to do like a trick or like trying to turn or something like that and then I fell but that was like my fault and then the third time I tripped because of a pebble like I grabbed the pebble and I was like this is the pebble that tripped me and then I was like ah. so ever since day one something was wrong with my board like I said I hadn't tried my board anywhere like I was waiting to take it to the skate park and 
we couldn't find a skate park. Like I knew there was a skate park in a certain neighborhood because I think there's only like one skate park in my city. So then my dad sees a straight empty road and then he's like skate here because like no cars are coming or anything like that. And then like, I personally thought that I couldn't skate because I was scared. I was like trying to like push and like the wheels would like literally only go from like probably one foot and then it would break. And then I'd be like, I think it's because like my body is tense, it's scared. That's why like the wheels aren't moving. And then I go to the skate park and then the same thing. And I'm like, wait, this is weird. Like literally the, the ground is so smooth. Like I should be able to like move like a long distance without stopping, you know? And then, so my dad says, maybe you, we need to put oil on the wheels. And then the skate park was actually pretty full that day. I, we went on a Sunday around like four. We went on Super Bowl. I got the skate park on the Super Bowl day. Super Bowl 2021. Yeah, yeah. Because we had to come back home to watch the game, you know? And the park was really full that day, actually. And then, like, I asked, like, three guys, like, hey, um, I just got this board. Like, can you give me any tips? Like, why isn't my board moving? Like, am I doing something wrong? Or, like, you know, I'm asking, like, questions because it's the first time I'm skating. Like, one thing is to watch videos on YouTube. And then one thing is to actually ask someone and someone actually conversate. Like, have a conversation about a skateboard, like, face to face. And, honestly, everybody was telling me, girl, you got a Walmart board. No, it's not going to work. You got a Walmart board. You got to go to the skate shop. You got to go to the skate shop. And then, but everybody was telling me about the barrels and wheels. They were telling me, okay, I understand you just bought the board and you can't really return it now that you've opened it and like the wheels are dirty and everything like that. So what I suggest to you is going to the skate park, going to the skate shop and switch out your barrels and get new wheels. Please don't get a Walmart board. Please don't get a Walmart skateboard. Please, please don't get a Walmart skateboard. And then he was like, honestly, Walmart boards are like a toy. So I'm, I'm, these are the words that the guy from Zoomies, the professional skater, told me. This is a toy. This crushes someone's dream. Like if I hadn't gone around asking people at the skate park for like tips and like showing them my board and like saying, hey, I'm skating for the first time. I honestly would have thought there was something wrong with me and my body was not responding to the skateboard and out of fear. I would have always thought like if I wouldn't have asked those people at the skate park, honestly, I would have given up skating and I would have said, I'm too scared. I can't do this. For some reason, my we like my body stops. I would have thought that. I honestly would have thought that. So I don't appreciate that this board does that. They should do like a warning sign on here. Or please, 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 if you see any skaters struggling and you notice that they have a Walmart skateboard, tell them. Tell them, like, yo, like, you're not a bad skater. It's the board that's not letting you skate. They're from the brand Spitfire and the barrels are from the brand Bone, I believe if I'm not mistaken, or or Red. Then the wheels came with stickers and look, I thought that they were so cute to put it here. Like you see the little Spitfire and then like you see how it's a little rocket ship, like poosh. I'm, an, I'm a rocket ship. I like neon colors, they're really dope. It's impossible to turn with these trunks, guys, because you can like loosen them. Because like if you get an actual skateboard from a skate shop, you're able to get metal trunks. And with metal trunks, you're able to get a skate tool and then you're able to screw it, like put it looser, put it tighter. And the more looser you put it, the more you're able to do like turns and you're able to like curve because like my skate park is like curved in a way it's not a straight line it's a way where like you could like turn like a car you know like like that i mean well i can't do that with this board because this board is like like this like you could literally only go straight so you could probably turn as like like this and that's all you can't really turn like this no you can't okay so I found out that Tony Hawk has two types of skateboards. Tony Hawk has like his Walmart brand skateboard. And then he also has a skateboard that's like sold at actual skate shops. And they're actually really good quality. So yeah. Get the Tony Hawk boards but at the skate shops. I like to consider my channel the random channel because like when video I'm talking about school the next video I'm talking about skateboarding the next video I'm talking about skincare the next video I'm talking about hair I love my channel I, I love here you're able to find everything I'll see you very very soon my mermanicorn if God permits